Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. I don't know the rest of these lyrics. Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. You old silly fucking bear. Hey guys, welcome to another video from us here at Behind the Fiends. I have no clue what the hell I'm about to watch. And I need to adjust my microphone. Give me just a second. There we go. Um, I got told by Luke that the new Winnie the Pooh Blood and Honey trailer just dropped today. And we're going to watch it and react to it. And I have no fathomable idea why in the fuck I'm about to watch I heard about this movie supposedly going to come out um, a few months back and I totally thought it was some kind of fucking joke, a meme, something. I didn't think this was real. Um, according to articles and stuff, I guess the Winnie the Pooh license is now in the public domain, so that's how this... Uh, Particular group of filmmakers are able to make this movie. I'm surprised Disney didn't try to stop them. I'm pretty sure on the down low somewhere they probably tried and failed because of the public domain thing. I'm flabbergasted. I did. Like I said, I thought this was like some kind of crazy meme. Like no way in a hundred years would we ever see a Winnie the Pooh horror movie. He's beloved by children, for God's sake. I mean, I grew up with Winnie the Pooh. I remember watching Pooh Corner on Disney Channel when Disney Channel first came out back in the 80s. Yeah, I'm that old. I've been around since the birth of freaking cable. I remember when MTV launched before they had stupid shows like Jersey Shore and 16 and Pregnant or whatever the fuck. But uh, anyway... Let's just watch this thing. So, here we go. You know, you're the first person I ever shown this place to. Why am I so special? Well, at least they got a Christopher Robin with a British accent. That's nice. Close now. We're not going to find them. We will. Pooh, Piglet, Eeyore. We were friends for many years. Oh, that's wow. not very ominous. Christopher, we need to leave. Jesus. They now. fucking killed Eeyore. Really <laughs> what the happened, though, okay? What? Pooh and him had pretty nice. Oh, yeah, she's fucked. Oh, so because he abandoned them, they've now become wild. This place is kind of cool. Um, this is kind of cool. We need to go. There's. There's Laura's there. Let out. Let what out? There's someone else outside. What was that? Piglet mask looks sick, bro. Oh damn. Oh shit. Piglet is not playing. Why are you doing this, please? I would have never left that swear. I swear. Run. I cannot believe that this is actually a thing. And I'm going to admit right now, I am so down for this. This might be the horror movie of 2022. And I'm saying that in a year that we're getting ready to get Halloween ends. I'm going to call it right now, guys. Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. It's going to be a horror movie of 2022. It's going to beat out Black Phone. Halloween ends, orphan first kill, anything else. No, that's not even possible, but 
it's not shot great. That's for damn sure. Uh, the effects look good. Um, the characters of Pooh and Piglet look really weird. It just looks like two fat guys with some cheap Halloween masks on. But obviously the masks move because they showed Piglet being able to open the mouth. I, I'm i so fucking lost for words. I can't believe this is a thing. Hey, guys, look. Uh, I'm down for this. I mean, what's next? Are we going to get, like, Mickey Mouse Club from hell or a uh, goof troop that's, like, killing everybody or tailspin that's, like, a bear loose on a plane mauling people? Sky's the limit, right? But, uh, yeah, guys, I am definitely down for this. This looks pretty cool. Like I said earlier, I thought it was some kind of stupid joke. But it's a real thing, and, uh you guys have watched this trailer just let me know uh, what you thought of it right down here in the comments and while you're at it hit the subscribe button hit that notification bell and uh stay up to date when we release new content like this right here and uh, as always holy shit i can't believe this is a real thing this has been your old buddy john and i'll see you again next time on behind the fiends Ooh.